Hello everyone, Bob's the 1984 back again. Newcastle United have lost 1 0 away to Leicester City in Rafa Benitez's first game in charge. Um, and I'm, I'm sitting here disappointed, obviously, because we've got beat, but I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here not disappointed in our performance. Uh, we, we definitely played a lot better than we have um, in, in recent games. Um, and we were beaten by one moment of, of magic, really. Um, a goal from Shinji. Okazaki, Okazaki, whatever you call him, but yeah, I mean, from from the starting lineup, um, it was pretty obvious that it was a Rafa Benitez team. Um, it was it was deliberately set up to be organised and be hard to beat, very narrow from striker to defence, um, always there to make it look really compact and and really hard for Leicester to, to break us down, and and with the starting eleven. Mitrovic up front by himself, Wijnaldum behind him, and um, obviously Kolbach filling in at left back for um, Dummett, who I believe was injured or was he or was he available? Uh, with Taylor and Lachelles and Yamat in defence, I was a little bit surprised he didn't go for Townsend to start. Um, however, I don't really think there was much else he could have done. He did place a stroke on the left, which was a surprise, and Perez on the right. Um, and in the first couple of minutes, Newcastle had a couple of chances, and you know they're immediately within about thirty seconds of the game. So was immediately pressing Schmeichel. He's on top of Schmeichel, and you're thinking, well, hold on, he wouldn't have done that last week. Um, so yeah, so it was a pretty bright opening from Newcastle. I mean, Leicester really didn't get a hold of the game. They didn't really stamp their authority on it. Um, and before you know it, we're, we're five attempts to nil up <laughs> without really doing anything in terms of testing Schmeichel, to be honest. Um, all, what I remember is a, is a Perez snapshot that went wide and obviously a few few little scuffles, but we didn't really have anything of note um, that was testing Kasper Schmeichel in goal. Um, and then they score, um, which came about from a, a free kick from Colback. Um, Sorry, um, from a foul by Kalbach on Mores. Um, it was a bit of a nothing challenge, to be honest. He did look for it. He did fought the floor far too fucking easy, as far as I'm concerned. Um, but the, from the resultant free kick, the ball is floated in. Mitrovic clears it, but the header doesn't really go anywhere. Gets to about the 18-yard line, and the ball is then put back in. There was a little bit of debate on Monday Night Football about Vardy being offside. I don't really think he could, um, you know, grief the, the official for not giving it. But he gets a head up back in in Okazaki with a nice overhead kick. And that's Newcastle 1 0 down. But Newcastle responded quite well to it. Um, with Again, without really testing anyone going forward in that final third. And then the second half, Newcastle really started to dominate possession. Um, winning the midfield battle but again chances were at a premium at the other end of the field and it was looking like it was going to be another toothless night and unfortunately proved to be so the only chance really in the second half of note was when Sissoko managed to break in and he was in he got he got himself into the box and only I think is just have a crack at it lad and he didn't and the chance was gone and you know, as I say, I'd, there was enough in that 90 minute performance to, to give every Newcastle fan a bit of hope. Um, but let's be brutally honest, I mean, we all thought we would get beat today. If, you, if you're really honest with yourself, you cannot be too disappointed um, in terms of the performance. I think we played, as I say, we, played, we did play quite well. Um, you can see within three days and three training sessions, there was, there was a bit of a rough stamp on that performance. Um, but... To go down one nil away to, um, you know the, the team that is obviously top of the league, five points clear now. I really can't see much between, you know, if you watch that game and, and you and you know nothing about football and you were told to guess who was the team top of the league and who was nineteenth, we really couldn't pick out too much of a difference between the sides. Um, but yeah, overall, I'm I mean, I'm disappointed we've lost, but I'm I'm not disappointed in the performance. I did think we played well, but we are a little bit toothless up front and hopefully we can sort that out on Sunday against Sunderland uh, on, on Sunday against Sunderland um, but yeah overall I'm not disappointed what were your thoughts everyone did you um, have any other opinions on that on our performance what did you think of the lineup 
and the substitutions made were you happy with how we played um leave some comments down below um but thanks very much for watching my name is bob so 1984 i'll see you all later